internet. I know, I know, I'm a little bit late, but at least it's happening. From the moment I got back from my trip to England, things have been absolutely crazy. But I am here to bring you my obsessions from July. So naturally, let's get on with it. I am obsessed with traveling this month. The trip to England was amazing. I had the most brilliant time. It was so fun. I've been putting up vlogs of our trip and I put up six of the 10-ish days so far and I'm really, really working hard to get the last couple put up. But if you'd like to watch those vlogs and see what we were up to in England, you can go to the playlist that starts right here. Um, feel free to watch all of those videos and keep an eye out for the new ones. Also, before we went to England, I went up to Pittsburgh for a weekend over 4th of July to see my family and I took some footage but I never got to put it up, so here's a little bit of that. Traveling is one of those things that I think I will probably always be obsessed with. It's one of those things like they say about tattoos, like you get one, you want to get more. Well, with traveling, you go one place, so you want to go to more places. But I know that it's not easy and it's not cheap and it's scary, but I really hope that I can continue to do it and I can continue to keep having new experiences. To give you an update from a previous obsession, in April I told you that I was obsessed with coffee smoothies from this coffee place called Rise Up. <laughs> well, I'm here today to tell you that my obsession with coffee smoothies has turned into a rapidly increasing coffee addiction. I'm not a big fan of hot beverages, and so I haven't actually tried hot coffees yet, but iced coffees are my new thing. It's like, it makes me feel so much better and they're so good. I can't believe I've been missing out on it for so long. I actually bought some of those little Starbucks drinks that you can get the Frappuccino things and I've got some in my fridge right now. I'm not proud of the obsession and I was off caffeine for quite a long time, but now I'm kind of back on it because my life a little bit requires it and also because the way of getting it into my mouth is so good. I will say that I have tried a couple different types of iced coffees now, but the coffee smoothie from Rise Up Coffee is still my favorite. A podcast that I'm obsessed with this month is called Dear Hank and John. Yes, it is John and Hank Green. Yes, I'm obsessed with everything they do. I'm not even sorry about it. These guys like really like to think and discuss important topics. It's really good. I've enjoyed listening to it. I've laughed a lot while listening to it. John's been pretty busy the last month, so they've had special guests. There's Maureen Johnson, Emma Blackery, Grace Helbig. It's been really great to listen to. I highly recommend if you are just looking for kind of an easy to listen to podcast. I also listened to a book trilogy this month. I listened to the audiobooks and the trilogy was the Unbecoming of Mara Dyer trilogy. I was pleasantly surprised with it. I felt like that it was a little bit different than things I had read before. Overall the ending of the story was kind of exactly as you would expect. <laughs> But the way that they got there might have been a little bit different. I definitely really liked the first book. The second and third were maybe a little bit drawn out, but I enjoyed listening to them. They were a fun piece of fluff to add into my month. Let me know if you've read or listened to those books and what you thought of them. And you know I love to end these obsession videos with some overarching idea for the month or concept, but travel's really been the main thing. Um, the new experience, this thing, is very much in the core of going traveling and new experiences are something that I feel like everyone should be having and if you're not having new experiences then you're not growing as a person and if you're looking back at the old you and feeling like you haven't changed that much it's probably because you haven't had many new experiences. So maybe, maybe that's what I'm gonna go with this month. I am obsessed with having new experiences because they make you into a better person and they make you into a person that you never knew you could be before. So, have some new experiences, take some time to go travel, listen to the Dear Hank and John podcast, read some books, tell me what your obsessions were in July, I'd love to hear them, and I will see you all later. Don't forget to watch the travel vlog seriously, here's a link. We're at a pub crawl, this is our first night in London, and we're doing a pub crawl, and we met all these really awesome people. 